We are playing Magical Dice Diary Horse Hall. Horse Hall, guys. Horse, Horse Hall. Hall. So, new game. We haven't played it at all. First go through. Um, I'm assuming it has a lot to do with Magical Girls, and that is making me feel amazing right now. I heard there was a lot of... The description on Steam said there's a lot of butt touching. Uh, if there's a lot of butt touching, I'm in. So, here we go. Uh, new game. Uh, Mary Sue, what do we want her name to be? We're not Mary Sue. Do you know what a Mary Sue is? Uh, I want to be. I want to have you having a Mary Sue. But let's go. No, a Mary Sue is someone who can't die or get bad things happen to them in a book or a or a movie. Yeah, they're the Mary Sue. That's what that means. They're they're the uh, they're the they they're getting uh, uh, the Peter Dinklage syndrome. So you gotta you gotta name her. Tarek is in control. All right. So what do we want to name her? What do you have any? Yeah, I can. You give me the keyboard. All right, if you want me to name her, I'll I want freaking you to name, name her. her. <laughs> what did you it's, do? It's, uh, it, it grabs you. Go ahead. Go ahead. Now go. What go. Do you, no, stop it. You're, you're messing it up. Okay, you got it? Click there. Go ahead. Okay. Is that how you spell that? No, that's what we're going with. <laughs> oh, this, okay, so we, we lost an H. Right, Diarrhea. Diarrhea. <laughs> Diarrhea. I cannot, I cannot spell. That's fine. Last name? Blunderbust. Diarrhea Blunderbust. There we go. Uh, style. Let's, let's find some styles here. Um... <laughs> Now we all know Ooh, that I can't Afro spell. Princess. Um, no, keep, keep going. Uh, okay. Dreads. Style zero. This can be. It should be bald. Ooh, pigtails. Uh, that's Ooh, it. that's short hair. This one. God, yeah, that's awesome. Color. White. I love white hair. Uh, you okay? So Diary of Blunderbust. Corey's Dream Girl. That's what we got here. Hell yeah. Uh, did I pass it up again? Right, right you missed it. There. So that's that's kind of pinky purple. That's as best as we're going to get, though, I think. Yeah, yeah. Right there. That's perfect. That's good. All right. Face. Face. Whoa, no. No. Oh, oh come on. Ooh. That's all right. That's fine. You know what? You choose this. I like the Haruko look. Let's go with that one. And, uh... Eye color. You can choose her eyes. You... Where, where are you going? What are you doing with this? Um, what kind of eye color are you into? There. That one? Yep. Skin color. Yeah, Beige. That's, that's, that's beige. White. Not too white. Super white. Dark. Beige? That's good. Yeah, that's a good. Whoa. Yeah, that one. I think body type one. I wish it was like a, a big chunky. Like, that, that one is kind of chunky. Kind of kind of squeezable girl. That one's a little bit more squeezable than this one. So we'll go with squeezier. Okay. Alright. Alright, there's Sounds our girl. Good. Diarrhea. Diarrhea. Uh, Blunderbust. Bust. Yes. Uh, yes. She's a fantastic name the girl has. I you're, started you're about three years ago on my 13th birthday. Playing tag in the back garden with my friends, but when I tried to jump out of the way, all the girls... who was or, Sorry, out of the way of the girls who were chasing me... I jumped so high that I flew all the way over the, the hedge. Intriguing. Uh, at first, I couldn't believe it was real. No one else could either. Uh, within a few minutes, they'd all convinced themselves that nothing unusual had happened. Then the next day, a strange old woman showed up to my doorstep to offer me a choice for my future. Interesting. And now, here I am, 16 and on my way to this academy, uh, an actual school for magic. So some random person walked up to you after you jumped over a hedge and just like, told you, "Hey, you're going hey, to do come, school. Come play. Come learn magic with me." Diarrhea. You seem like a strong person. Let's go ahead let's and go have you. It. Let's throw you into another university. You'll probably do fine. School lies in a hidden valley in the Green Mountains, about 150 miles from my home in New Hampshire. What? Oh, we live in America. Oh, yeah, we're living in New Hampshire. New okay. Hampshire. Sure. So, right. The Green Mountains is very close. It's very... 150 miles away from New Hampshire. If you didn't know that, 
Uh, that's a Snapple fact for you right now. Uh, my parents drove me... Pop that cap off, and there it is. Yeah, my parents drove me out there, uh, but we've already said our goodbyes. I asked them to drop me off the outskirts of uh, the new school. Uh, Isn't that always awkward when you're like, goodbye, yeah, goodbye, uh, and, then, and then you're like walking uh, the same place? Bye, Ma. Uh, it's like, oh yeah, I'll see you later, I'll see you later, and then you start walking the same direction. And so then wait, you're like, on. Then you're like the quiet walk. <laughs> <laughs> you're like in silence, you're kind of like, I guess we should say goodbye again. I have, a, I have a small issue with this. Some random lady told her that she should go to this, this academy, and her parents bought it. And not only that, but they've been driving her to school. They're, they're driving her to school. To magic school. They're like, it's they, paid for. At one point, yeah, well. <laughs> fuck, you, Good riddance, little girl. Go, good, go learn tax magic. Money. It, it's all go, scholarships. Go learn magic. Oh, yeah, yeah, magic, yeah. Get, get her out of the freaking house. Yeah, she always sits Hi. around playing with her friends. It's like, it's like before we had kids. <laughs> <laughs> Boarding school time. So uh, let's go ahead and see what's going on here. Uh, I knew my dad would cry uh, and, wow, uh, fuss over me before letting me go. I didn't want my new classmates to see me for the first time looking like that. Uh, actually, I'm surprised Dad agreed. He's always been a little overprotective. Maybe he finally recognized that I'm not a little kid anymore. Or maybe he wants to just... Get blowjays from mom. Yeah, I know. While right? you're out of the house, that's most likely what's going on here. He doesn't trust you at all. He's not, just like, not whew, not finally, she's gone. <laughs> anyway, it's uh, it's me. It uh, means that I have to carry my own suitcases, which contains all that I have to my name for the next nine months. Not many clothes because we'll be wearing school uniforms all the time. So she's gone some, for nine months. She's, she's gonna, gonna have a little sister when she comes home. She's gonna have not only a little sister when she comes home, but she's gonna have no clothes when she comes home. I'm positive. <laughs> she, nine months is a long time. She's gonna grow. She's a hefty girl already. <laughs> she's either growing or she's, she's getting like... smaller. And either way, those clothes are not fitting. But at the end of nine months, um, there are some books, pictures of my friends and family, and decorations from any room. Ooh, nice star wipe. All right, star wipes. Uh, there it is up ahead. Ooh, this looks like a giant fucking university for magic. You think it'd be like this little hovel of a place, or like Hogwarts, yeah, or like Hogwarts, where, like Hogwarts where you have to transfer. No, no, no. We no, got it's, upstairs. It's, There's it's, a wall, and there's it's a basically o Oxford. That's what we're going, going for right here. There, going there are fraternities, and there's a lot of things going on that nobody gonna, wants. We'll to play like, hacky sack in the quad. Yep. Uh, campus looks more like a very posh boarding school at home for witches and wizards. Uh, pretty buildings, blah, 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 blah. I walk a little faster, being slightly too warm in the long robe and cape. So we still gotta wear, we still have to wear witch's clothes, but, you know, we don't study in a castle or anything. No. Um, flower beds and uh, arches stretch out around me. So many doors and windows that they all look the same. There are three residential halls for girls and three for boys. Well, that's their boys. The exact amount of uh, eat for each. They have to accept the exact amount of people every time. I've been accepted to Horse Hall, which is one, which is for adventurous girls. Ooh, that means they're all sluts. So all of these chicks, total sluts. Well, good. That's good for them. Yeah, you want to b bunch those girls up in one dorm so they don't affect <laughs> the other girls who are actually there what? to study. <laughs> the other two girl girls halls are the butterflies, who are probably girly girls. Um, and the snakes. I'm not sure. The snakes are probably lesbians. They're, so they're, they're Slytherins. They're, they're snakes who are lesbians. There's butterflies who are This the... is just like Hogwarts, only like upscale. It's a, it's a, it's a high class Hogwarts. It's an upscale Hogwarts. I'm not sure who would want to be a snake. I'd rather be a horse. Really? Who would want to... I think I'd be a snake. Snakes are pretty bad. I'd be, yeah, I'd be a snake rather than a horse. Yeah, fuck horses. No one wants to be a nobody butterfly. nobody wants to be a butterfly. If nobody. you're classified as a butterfly, you are probably it's the bottom. snake, then horse, then, then butterfly. butterfly. Butterfly on the bottom. Uh, well, butterflies probably are on the bottom. That's, well, that's I true. don't know. We're not girls. Well, so horse all. Let's go. I'm taking off my shoes. Uh, I if, have you, a, if you smell something, it's, it's, it's just, that. Just know that you're not having to smell the full effect. Um, uh, I need to. I learned about fresh my here where, while I talk. Where did I? Where did I put it? Um, like down my suitcase while I walk, trying to remember which pocket I stuck the letter into. When suddenly, boom! I bump into somebody. Is that, that a dude? It looks. Well, diarrhea says, "Oops, <laughs> sorry." I bumped in. Okay, an older man in school robes with no hall symbol on, uh, which means he's probably a professor. This is not a good first impression. Don't, don't bump the mic, Sorry, man. sir. A new student, I see. And what might your name be? He has a lovely voice, dark and rich, with a, with a refined British accent. 
and he doesn't seem to be too angry with me. I relax a little. I love how there's just a lot of exposition. Diarrhea blunderbuster. I just got here and I'm not sure wh uh, where I'm supposed to go. I'm pretty sure this professor now thinks that you are just the shittiest kid in the world. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> it's in your name. My voice trails out as I, <laughs> as I notice. You are a no shitty longer. kid. Well, they call me diarrhea. For a reason. My parents hate me. Um, he's no longer looking at me. Instead, he's pay paging through a large book he was carrying. Miss... Oh, hey. oh sorry. Don't take my lines. These are my Good lines. Point. I take them seriously. Dark, dark, robust, and British. Go. Miss Blunderbusted, is it? Wild Seed. How unsurprising. Wild? Diarrhea said. More than likely a complete waste of my time. You have no idea how much you have been given, and you will throw it all away. He scribbles something into the books and then slams it shut. Tender merits! Not the promising start. What a douchebag. Pay more attention to your studies than do. than you do. Than right, you do to where you're walking, Miss Blunderbust! Or you'll find yourself expelled from this academy before the new year! I'll see you in your, my office for the whippings you will get! I take no pleasure in it. <laughs> Oh, but he did. With a snap of his wrist, and his, uh, he wraps his cape around him and stalks away. Stalk, 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 stalk. I love capes, man. They're pretty bad. Oh, they God. make you look so distinguished. Woo. I haven't even started school yet, and until and uh, already everybody hates me. All well, the teachers hate me. Already. We haven't started. We'll start tomorrow. All right. So mm -hmm. next time on next Truly Evil Games, we will find out where exactly the school, uh, what exactly the school has to offer, and where the whippings take place. Apparently they're in a bathroom. Naughty 